Carfax of Mars. And what you're seeing is one of the mole YTPO videos that are being targeted by anti-freedom leftists on YouTube. And they're doing a pretty good job of it. Now take a look below here. Comments are disabled. Take a look at the sidebar. There's no related content. Stranger Things cast answer the web's most searched questions. Come back, Barack. Christina Aguilera. All garbage that I wouldn't even touch. So, the uh, anti freedom scumbags are going around having these videos censored. Now, this is actually. This is symptomatic of a large problem, however. I'm going to take you to on my own chat group. I have somebody who doesn't like the sources that I use. See, I use a wide variety of news sources. But she insists that I use sources that are approved and efficient, like Communism Broadcasting System, National Broadcasters of Communism, American Broadcasters of Communism, etc. Or my personal favorite, Politburo Broadcasting System, uh, PBS. Uh, do you get the point? <laughs> the key word is communism. Now, she insists I use one of her approved sources on my chat group. Last time she did it, I said, you don't like sources you use for the story? You go look it up yourself. It's not my problem. It's the same issue, folks. Whether you have leftists screaming, pedophile, 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 or the screaming, Alex Jones, Alex Jones, Alex Jones, like parrots. You see, uh, Alex Jones, and this has been admitted to by YouTube, it's tough to put him down because he's so popular, but they do, it's been admitted uh, on tape that YouTube is essentially trying to put so-called mainstream news above Alex Jones on the search listings. Uh, I get a lot of that myself as my rings are in dumps and I think they're mostly hiding things. Hiding my videos. But this is the same people doing, doing this. They're trying to tell you you can't listen to Alex Jones because he's harmful. You cannot listen to Alex Jones because listening to Alex Jones is harmful. Where do we see this? Well, it's the same basic principle as in North Korea. These people think exactly like uh, Kim Jong-un. But the difference here is in this country the government's prohibited from really doing this so we have Google and YouTube they're trying to uh, censor tell us who we can watch and who we can't. And of course we have these trolls on YouTube these left wing fanatics who are going around having these videos censored. Alright, this one's not more YTPO, this is my morning. Comments are disabled, they might have been disabled by the user. We're going over a few of these, just showing the lead on. I don't know, in some cases they seem to be eliminating any related search results. In other cases, they're simply disabling comments. I'm pretty sure that's YouTube doing that. Here you go again. Comments are disabled for this video. This gives you an idea of the mentality. 
These are perfectly legal to watch. I'm not talking about child porn. That's a different subject. Entirely. Child porn is commercial exploitation of children. I think most people agree that should be illegal. Including myself. Uh, but we're not talking about commercial exploitation of children. We're talking about children who upload their videos. And they do it voluntarily. The way I see it, you know, if they, you know, if they cross the community guidelines, then they should be held accountable. But other than that, it's up to me to decide what, what to watch or what not to watch. But we have these people who want to stop me from watching these videos or watching Alex Jones or, you know, Wild Bill for America. Sometimes I watch his. You name it. They want you to watch the official people. People they trust. That's censorship, folks. And they've created a mini state within YouTube to censor and tell us what we can and cannot watch. Now, on the more white APO front, if we let this continue, essentially what they're, they're telling us is that Men are not allowed to watch, are not allowed to see children in videos. That's essentially what they're saying. See, women are pure, so they can watch anything they want. But we have to be limited to watching male sports and, uh, shall we say male bedroom sports? I'm going to leave it at that. That's considered pure natural, don't you know? by the twisted individuals. And that's the moral YTPO wars in a nutshell. It's a fight between the people who believe it's their divine, well, they don't, not divine because they don't uh, believe in anything divine, but they believe it's their mission in life to censor, tell others what they can and cannot see, and know that and on the other side, there's freedom-minded people like myself who basically want to see what, a, what we want to see. I watch a wide, wide variety of videos, including UFO, news, rarely sports, and, yes, Russian videos. Too bad. That's my business, it's not yours. I doubt seriously anybody's going to make these videos illegal because there would be little public support except from a bunch of whining, narcissistic idiots who think that it's their job in life to control everyone and everything. Now, you think I'm being harsh? Okay, I'm going to show you a different type of video. Inside North Korea, this is from the uh, Communism News Network. I'm surprised, actually, they're not saying how great things are in North Korea, but, uh... It's, it's a choice between freedom, where some things you may not like, uh... others seeing, are gonna get seen, on the other hand, you have something like North Korea. As the uh, people on the other side of the Mo YTPO wars are actively pursuing a life like they have in North Korea, whether they admit it or not. Starvation, death, misery, or freedom. There's really only two choices. I'm going to say that again. Star starvation, death, tyranny, misery. On one side, that's the people going after the YTPO videos. That's what they want, whether they realize it or not. On the other hand, you have freedom to watch what you want. And listen to the news sources you want, and so forth. So make, make no mistake, they're both related. I go a little long. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching. And... I hope... 
myself, I, I don't lose the freedom to watch anything more than male sports and male bedroom. And that includes male bedroom sports. I know if I uh, have a little more freedom than that. I'm Artifacts Mars. And you anti-mole white EPO people go back to your uh, male bedroom sports videos that you love so much. Thanks for watching.